New York Yankee star and early MVP candidate Aaron Judge confirmed that he did not suffer a fracture in his left hand after being hit by a ball in his team's victory over the Baltimore Orioles, New York Yankees 4, Baltimore 2, in the series opener on Tuesday night. As he confirmed after the match, Judge exited the game after the hit. However, Judge was not in New York's starting lineup for Wednesday's game, and coach Aaron Boone described him as an everyday player. I feel better. I feel better after we got some good news, Judge said after Tuesday's game. The X-ray and CT scan were negative. We're doing well. Huge relief. Having an injury in that area a couple of years ago and breaking your wrist in 2018, you don't know what's going to happen. Finding out it's not broken, it's definitely a sigh of relief. This is a fastball that Albert Suarez hit at 94.1 miles per hour, which struck Judge at the bottom of his hand instead of hitting it at the top. Judge ran around the bases and played in the field the next inning, and then Trent Grisham batted for him in the next inning. Judge was clearly in pain and discomfort after the ball hit him. In 2018, Judge missed nearly two months due to a small fracture in his right wrist after being hit by a grounder. That foul shot was more than just a direct hit, although the judge is unfortunately aware of the injuries that result from being hit. Needless to say, Losing Judge to a fracture would have been a devastating blow to a Yankees team with the best record in MLB. Judge is once again playing at an MVP level, .302 slash .428 slash .687 while leading the league in doubles, 22, home runs, 26, RBI, 64, total bases, 181, and war, 5.0. This is after a slow start to the season as well. The Yankees have lost several of their top offensive linemen to injury recently. Jason Dominguez completed his rehab period following Tommy John surgery, then suffered an oblique muscle injury while swinging last weekend. The Yankees are awaiting test results to determine the severity of the injury. Everson Pereira, who had a stint with the Yankees last year, underwent season-ending elbow surgery earlier this month. If Judge were to miss much longer, even if just a few days, the Yankees would put Gresham in center field and allow the two-time Gold Glove winner to catch everything he hits his way. The biggest problem is the loss of Judge's bat, which cannot be replaced. The Yankees still have Juan Soto, of course, but Soto and Judge make a solid duo. Yankees first baseman Anthony Rizzo broke a bone in his right arm after a collision at first base last Sunday. He will be out of action for eight weeks or so. New York will welcome Garrett Cole back into the starting lineup on Wednesday, but Rizzo is now out of the lineup. At least Judge escaped serious injury. The Los Angeles Dodgers lost star Mookie Betts to a broken bone in his hand when he was hit last weekend. He is expected to miss six to eight weeks. Tuesday's win improved the Yankees to 51-24 and the Orioles dropped to 47-25. They are 2.5 games behind New York in the AL East.